right guys welcome back to the channel this is going to be the first video in a series of videos to see if we can get this car tuned i've been tinkering on this car since 1997 and right now it gets about 12 miles to the gallon yeah she is running super rich now i don't know if it's the mass air meter and injectors that i bought years ago didn't match up correctly or i have no idea but at any rate it's running very rich the plan is to take it to the dyno and this video will be coming out probably next week um, we're going to take it to the dyno dyno it see where it is right now okay so the current modifications of the car it has a 351w i bought a 351w short block it was bored 40 over bringing it to 358. Uh, this car has 30 pound injectors a 75 millimeter mass air meter it's got the bbk shorty header ceramic coated cobra intake and it is lightly ported from the upper to the lower intake and from the lower intake to the heads. Okay, it has Edelbrock Street heads. Uh, MSD distributor, I had to buy a new distributor for the 351 because it needs to be a little taller. It has a 155 liter per hour fuel pump, two and a half inch off-road H-pipe and Flowmaster and matching Flowmaster catback system. Underdrive pulleys, the SN95 alternator upgrade and the XE276HR-12 comp cam and that cam has uh, 544 thousandths of lift okay the plan is to take it to the dyno uh, get this thing dyno just as it is and we want to see where we're at i'm going to order the the pimp xs computer system and that is based off of the mega squirt 3 platform this computer is a literally a drop-in replacement for your factory computer and even the new computer even comes in a factory computer case so we'll just unplug the old computer plug the new one in install the software on the laptop and see if we can't get this thing running halfway decent ourselves and once we can get it running halfway decent i'm going to go ahead and uh, delete the mass air meter <clears throat> off of this car and replace it with just a i'm probably just going to try to machine a tube to go in there and replace the mass air meter we get a little more flow coming through the intake there but we'll get this thing tuned and running about halfway decent and then i'm going to take it back to the dyno and pay this guy to dyno tune it and i'll have videos of all this so that you guys can watch I think it'll be a really fun journey to see. The main thing is we're going to see how much horsepower it's got before the computer and tune and see how much horsepower it's got after the new computer and tune. And I'll get all that on video, the dyno and everything. I got permission to video as he's dynoing and tuning. And like I said, guys, I've got receipts for parts I bought for this computer back to August of 1997. So I've had this guy a little while. I think that's about it as far as the power adders type things that I've done to the car. So let's just give you a little walk around, show you what we got. And I think right now we're running about 20 degrees base timing. I don't know if that has anything to do with how rich it's running. I did finally buy uh, the newer starter, the newer high torque starter. So it'll actually start without this super expensive Optima battery. All right, let's start it up and let you guys hear it run.
All right, guys, there we are. I've got it idle set at about 800, and it's a little rough there. And sometimes when you turn the air conditioner on, she'll cut off on you. Sometimes up to a stop sign, it'll cut off on you. But I'm hoping to get all that stuff rectified with the new computer. So like I said, guys, this is going to be a video series, so make sure you stay tuned. I hope it'll be a pretty exciting series for everybody. I'm going to try to do as comprehensive of a review as I can on the Pimp XS system. I'm going to show as much of the computer part of it as I can as far as how I tuned it. and I'll, I'll get a base tune for the 351W and the parts list that I have, and I'll upload it to my website so you guys can download it if you think you can use it. All right, guys, stay tuned. More videos to come. Like I said, uh, Dino next week. And I'll have that video up as quick as I get it edited. Thanks for watching.